What do you do when disaster strikes your farm? What do you do as a family uh, when, when the worst thing that could happen to you and your farm business uh, takes place? I had a, a young individual named Dane that recently uh, contacted me. He was interested in joining the family farm. He was highly educated. He was an architect. But something was drawing him back to the family farm. Well, this disaster wasn't necessarily a, a, a hailstorm. It's when we suddenly lose our father, the main individual that was running that farm, who would be the mentor to Dane. I remember the, the second time that Dane came into my office and I was expecting a, a good report that things had gone well with the discussions with the family. And he came in and he was very quiet, very solemn. And finally he said to me, he says, Dave, he says, we lost our dad. You know, he was struck suddenly by, by an illness that no one could have expected. Um, no one was trying to, you know, deal with and it's just, boom, he's gone. And you've got to make a lot of decisions. Fortunately, um, Dane is very level-headed, very, uh, very much in control of his life. And I think between him and his brother and his mother, as a family, they, they sought back um, to extension and said, how do we get through this? What do we have to do? I consider myself a team member for Dane's family. I consider myself someone that has knowledge of, of hundreds of other families that have been through succession planning. So several times Dane has mentioned how we as a, as a specialist in this field uh, gave them confidence to carry on. Iowa State University Extension Outreach has a very diverse group of, of specialists. And I think in most all cases we're trying to improve the lives of Iowans and help them to make better decisions based off of research data as well as other experiences that those specialists have had in, in, all, of, in all of Iowa. And I think Extension addresses that in, in helping farm families go into the future to be sustainable type businesses. And so I think that's why I enjoy my job. I, I work with farm families to help them to get along, to go into the future, uh, to fulfill their dreams. I look forward to working with Dane and his family to continue their farm legacy.